Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Hyrule Warriors Age of Peace. And my laptop hard drive is still dying, so I had to pause just then because it, it froze and the recording froze and... But it's okay now. I really need to do something about that at some point though. Since it's not gonna last forever. And I don't want it to die. And not be, be able to recover anything at the, after a certain point. So yeah. Let's have a look at all this in here. Ah! Stasis! Oh my goodness, look at all of that power. 400 KOs, and let's get rid of you. Please, thank you, weak point smash. Looks like there's a chest nearby. It also looks like there's probably... No, I don't know. Hopefully there's going to be some Koroks nearby. So I can have a look at that. Anyway, let me get that, please. Oh, did I, I... I opened it. Okay, cool. Um... No, Korok sent, uh, telling me to go places. I guess. Let me just blow these up, just because. Did I blow up? Yeah, I did. Nice. Okay, there's a lot of food here. That's surprising. Did I not... I did. And I got that Korok there, so that's why there's no Korok around here. Okay then, well, let's have a look at you, Ice Wizard Robe. Special you out of existence. Just like that. Please, 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 there we go. Okay, and let's take a look around and see if we can find more Korok. So I don't know where I should look. Well, there's a side room over here. Already got a Korok in there. Cool. Good. Great. If I get near one, I probably don't need to worry that much because it'll peep at me. Supposedly. In theory. There's also one on the balcony I'm pretty sure that we've already got. Although that might be a different mission entirely that I'm thinking of. But anyway, let's take care of this guy. I use my special again. Not quite there yet. But if I can get his weak point down, we can do that. Okay, good. Let's go up or down this way. Got a Korok there as well. White main Lionel has appeared. Bombs, please. Thank you. Oh my goodness, all the KOs from that. Using my special against you. Let's slash at you some more. Have I missed something? I've got all of the... the chests now. But I'm concerned if I'm missing... Koroks. Oh. That's gonna miss, yeah. I'm assuming there's still more Koroks in here because of the thing not being darkened completely now. Still got light spot in the middle. I'm hoping that I'm right about that. Ow. Just gonna fight some of you guys. Oh my gosh. Nope. That's no good. Not good at all. Oh, my goodness, please. What's the special year? What's stasis? Good. Weak point smash, thank you. Okay. We're almost there. Oh, ice. Thank you. Very nice. Bombs. Okay. Oh, almost. Bad timing. Ow. Very bad timing. Wow. Let's warm up. 
Not even that was enough. Wow. Okay, fly rush, weak point smash. Just a little further on out. But I still think I'm missing a Korok, so what is happening? Number of Guardians have appeared. Because this is almost out. Escape from Horror Castle. Wait for the exit point. Oh, yeah. There's this path over here that I haven't seen because of it being ruined in the future version. But, okay, that's just it. Okay. I'm concerned, because there's definitely more Koroks than that. Okay. How much did I mess up? I didn't at all. Cool. Good. I got all the Koroks. Okay, well now that that's done, I guess I should head back to the first level and get the last treasure chest there. And then just rush through the rest. Seals, Korok Sensing. The Sheikah Sensor can detect Koroks on the battlefield. Head in the direction with the strongest reaction. Thank you for telling me that thing that I already knew and the only reason I'm going back to these things, you know? Very important. Just gonna dance in the corner. Things I do when I'm waiting for things to load. Let's go. So, the last treasure chest is way over that way. It shouldn't take too long to get over there once we've actually taken out some of these enemies at the front here. Which I can just walk through and defeat, so. There's also one other chest that I forgot to, um, to show at some point. I'm pretty sure, although I think I've already mentioned it. It's at the front of one of the outposts on the opposite side. So, let me... Oh, is this not going to open until I go to the other side? Great. Just what I want to see, I guess. Why not? Is that where I'm going? I think that is. Yeah. Where the smoke and all the moblins are just coming from. Oh, it brings back memories from when we started this whole thing. My regular attacks are doing so much health. So much damage. And this is just with a stick, so... Well, he's done. Let's keep the momentum going. Okay, the other doors have opened up, but I'm going to quickly go past here to show where I got the other chest. So, if you didn't get chests off screen accidentally and not realize that they went away forever, there's a chest right over here with 100 rupees in it. So, there we go. Now let's head to the other way. And I think once I have done this chest, I'm just going to cut ahead. Let's go all the way across. Oh my goodness. Such a large area, but we seem to be traveling across it fairly quickly. I wonder how much it changes size depending on uh, like what part of the game you're up to. Because this level is reused, but it's in different themes, so it could be a completely different could be a completely different level and not actually a different theme for it. Okay, well, the chest is this way somewhere. Let's just go like that. Oh, it's just like at the back of one of the buildings over here. I'm surprised I didn't find it accidentally because I've been past here a few times. Multiple playthroughs or attempts or whatever. It's right there, okay. Cool, anyway, and I'll see you after this battle. Okay, so, now that that's done, let's have a look at the chapters. Looks like we've done all of one. Now, level, chapter two, we've done me for the Zora Princess. But all the other ones seem to have a lot left. Especially the Abosa one, so... Let's have a look at doing it. And I might even keep Abosa there. We need a lot of chests and a lot of Koroks, so... Let's do that. And if I can get other people, other characters, uh, Korok sensors, that would also be good.
Okay, here we go. And also I realized I probably should pay attention to how many there are Cameron Korok star in a level so I don't actually forget about that. And then spend a long time wondering if I've actually got them all or if I've not because this doesn't seem to be any indication of if you have them all or not, so... That's gonna be a bit of a problem, but I'm assuming that they're only gonna have Koroks in... ...places that would make a bit of sense, I suppose? Like... I don't know. But, we'll figure it out. And if I miss some, then I'll just have to go right back in. Back in. Let's go get this chest that sell all the way out here. And there's a Korok out here as well. Which is probably right next to the chest, if I had to guess, so... There's the chest, and so the Korok is not over here. It's more over here, behind this. Let's blow that up. And then wonder what's happening. Okay. I don't think we've seen any times that we have to blow up a rock to get a Korok. That's very interesting. But I suppose that's going to be a regular thing now that we've finally found one of them. Which would explain why I haven't actually got all of them, because it's just not easy to see. Not really something I was aiming to find in the first place, so. But anyway, let's uh, follow the road a little bit, I suppose, to try and get more Koroks. I don't know how well this is going to work. I don't even know what the range is for the Korok sensor. They've taken the bait, now attack. Oh no, what a shame. Let's just cut through everything in here. Very nice. Ow. Let's get rid of you. Just like that. Now let's head back out and see what's over this way. A little bit. I'm willing to bet there's going to be some Koroks inside of the town itself that I've just missed. Oh my goodness. It's just right there. It's just... Oh, and this... Yeah. Wow. That works really well. For some reason, they put chests right next to the Koroks fairly often. But anyway, let's head over here and attack some of the soldiers or captains and all that. Ow. Ah. Okay. We point smash at 1 HP, I guess. Okay, and let me look around the main desert a little bit more. Just because I really want to make sure I get all Koroks. Ow, you hit me. Can't you tell I'm one of you? I'm wearing the right dress up for it. Let's go over here into the main army. Where are the captains there? There's one at least, so. Just gonna get you, weak point smash. Now it's gonna get rid of you completely, right? Yeah. Let's go over here, find the other one. I might even special. Just because. Okay, let's head over to the town and let's go in and see if we can find anything. I wish there was a way that I could actually know if I had all the Koroks or not, but it's that seems to be asking a lot, lot for some reason. Well, there is one in here somewhere. Based on the Korok sensor's light. Oh, do I need to capture this outpost? I need to capture this outpost. Okay. I can work with that. Oh, hello. Just gonna get you then. There we go. We can also get the chest that's over here. Is it in the house? It seems like it is. Oh, hang on. Right there. Cool. Korok is not in here. But it is definitely nearby. So how about we go around here. It's beeping at me. Seems to be close to the middle. Might even be over here. It could. Is it coming in? I can break the pots. Can I? Is it in a pot? I'll be very concerned. Concerned if it is. Is it over here? It's 
it's beeping a lot more over here. So it might actually be inside of the palace. Or maybe it's that there. Nope, no, it's not. I'm wrong. Let's head up here and find out what's happening. Okay. Let's check around. If the sensor could be helping me right now, that'd be great. Oh, here's a cork right here. Cool. Got you. But is there more in this town or not? There's a lot of area to explore, which is surprising. I still can't see how many I've got. Oh, there's a chest right here. Cool. Well, so I'm gonna switch to Link because that's why I couldn't see the sensor. Look around. Oh my goodness, brightness. There's nothing back here, apparently. Oh, it's so bright. So let's try this side. There's a Korok over here somewhere. Just need to figure out where exactly. Is it down this way? It might be. What happens if it's in one of these? I don't know. Ow. How dare you. You insult me. That's the wrong one. That's fine. Let me just finish you off. And let me get back to my croc search because that's what I'm here for. Maybe it's not down here. Maybe, maybe it is. Maybe I'm wrong. Let me check up here though. Again. Just to be certain there's nothing else up here. Yep. There's nothing behind this area, is there? No. Zoom in on the map so I can actually see what I'm looking at. Ah! Getting stuck on everything. In a small area. It does seem to be out here somewhere. Is the sensor increasing as I go down this way? Yes. It's like right here. Possibly in this house. Just look around. Look carefully. And then be disappointed. Okay. Alternately, can I go up here? No, I cannot. It's like right out here somewhere. I can go up here. Oh, hello. Well, there's a chest. And it really says that there's a cork around here. So near that I don't even know. Just thought I saw something and I'm just going crazy now. It's flashing a lot. They're like in the barrels. I don't think I can open the barrels. Oh, this is so confusing. But it's okay, I'll figure it out. Unless it's over this way. Oh, right there. Cool. Let's grab that. Drop my controller. I don't know how you managed to drop a controller like that, but alright. Let's go in here again. Just to make sure there's nothing. Yep, cool. I think I've actually caught up on the Koroks inside of the city now. Or the town. So let's just finish up everything out here then. Just like that. And I'm willing to bet that there's a lot more Koroks than that just around the place that I still need to find. Let's go get this last Yiga Blade Master. <laughs> Goodbye. Now to figure out the last other Korok seeds. Just go through here. Hmm. 
nothing immediately out here. But there's a lot of space, so... Let's just keep an eye out. There's a Korok there, so we've already got that. And obviously, if I go to where the chest is on the map, there's probably going to be a Korok around there somewhere. It's going to blow you up quickly. Thank you. Weak point smash. I'm going to leave the main objective alone for the moment. Okay, there's a Korok nearby. Hang on. There's a little thing over here. I'm guessing it's not in there because the thing's not beeping at me about it. Anymore, because I'm too far away. Okay. Let's try this direction then. It's probably in the middle bit somewhere. So let's go around. Oh, there it is. Oh, needs to be a stasis. There we go. Just like that. Oh, and there's another Korok. Somewhere. Possibly matching its position on the opposite side. No, maybe it's on the other side of this. This giant wall here. Which is not easy to go around. In fact, I have to actually go all the way around to the front of the, um, what's it called to actually get in there. Or, I progress the story a little bit and go all the way around, which just seems like a worse idea. So I'm going to actually hold off on that. I'm going to look at all these Lizalfos hiding here. Oh, I wish I could teleport. Teleporting would be good. I can switch to Urbosa if I need to progress the story. 